I've employed Rod to come into the schools. Um, he's been coming up to Bryn Tower for about uh, four weeks now, um, sort of taking sessions with, with the pupils up there. So he, you know, with discussions between myself, Deb, and uh, and Sarah, decided to bring pupils down to Velocity um, to give it a go down here, basically, just to introduce the pupils to uh, to the centre um, and hopefully. Um, improve their weightlifting techniques, cross, crossfit training, and, and so on. Um, it's not just weightlifting that Rod is looking to do. Um, he's also he has done sessions with med balls, um, kettlebells, and, and things like that. And hopefully the boys will have a sample of that tonight. Well, I've been going in lunch times on a Monday and been going through power cleans and jerks and squats, so leg leg based power. Uh, so why are the interest in weightlifting? Well, I've been injured um, and I'm trying to get back to fitness for rugby and I thought to improve my game the most, um, power is a key element of rugby, so I wanted to improve it by doing the weightlifting. So how have you found the session so far? They've been really good, really good. He knows his stuff, he's been involved in rugby, so he can make my sessions specific to uh, weightlifting for rugby, so it's been worthwhile. So you think it's something that you'll, uh, you'll stick with now in the future, and you've learned some techniques to take forward? Definitely, yeah, definitely. I'll stick with it now. I'll go to the same every Monday and go through my technique, but I can go away and do it myself then, which is uh, really good. Trying to like get get weightlifting going in South Wales, and uh, so this initiative we're going into schools, starting off through the 560 scheme. And today was an introduction, getting some of the boys in. We've linked in with CrossFit Velocity, which is a group in Swansea, and uh, we've given the boys a taster session, uh, a bit of weightlifting, a bit of CrossFit, and well, made them work hard basically. So, so how, how have you find, found them in school? So they, um, you know, are the kids uh, enthusiastic and receptive? One yes, and with weightlifting, it's it can be something. It takes a little bit of time to get going, and it it can be quite coach intensive. But uh, I think the boys can see whether it's for sport, weightlifting itself, or they can see the benefits for other sports that they play as well. As most sports, rugby, athletics, would use weightlifting movements as part of their training methods. To me, it looks like hard work. That looked like quite a good workout for the boys. Uh. Well, actually, with Nick, who runs CrossFit, I, we were talking before, and we were saying 10 minutes. Nick actually said eight, but halfway through, we had to stop at five, because uh, the boys found it extremely hard. But as we were saying to the boys, the better the techniques become, the easier the movements, and uh, they become a, bit, a little bit more efficient in their, their movement. So, uh, as you said, the hope is now work with more schools and, and, and get, more, get more involved. Yeah, and the aim for, obviously, from a weightlifting point of view, uh, the big drive with the sports, uh, with Sport Wales, is looking for the Commonwealth Games in 2014. Uh, there's a couple of boys we've earmarked already, we've picked up from other sports who've taken a liking to, uh, to weightlifting and we're looking to push them forward for the 2014 games.